So much can happen in a matter of seconds. And sometimes it's life-changing. You might only have between 5 and 10 seconds to see and react to an approaching aircraft. There are some procedures you can follow to make sure that you avoid an airprox. But first, the science bit. The eye is good at spotting lateral movement, even when the object is small. But when objects are static, they're not so easily noticed. A plane travelling towards you only grows slowly in size, appearing static, depending on your closure rate. It may not be until the last five seconds that the size difference is recognised by the eye. To help avoid an airprox, the most important thing is to look out. Try to look out of the cockpit for 80% of the time and only conduct in-cockpit tasks such as keeping an eye on your instruments for short periods of time. When looking out, use a scan technique to divide up the view out of the cockpit into left, centre and right. Then, much like following a karaoke dock, scan across the centre section, resting for one second at each point to give your eyes time to stabilise, then move to the left, back to the centre and to the right. Whilst doing this, have the radio and transponder on and listen to what's going on around you. And if you're unsure, don't be afraid to engage with air traffic or other pilots. These are a few of the techniques that can help you avoid an airprox. But for our full set of recommended procedures, visit our website. Make sure you follow these simple steps so that you're around to see those life-changing moments.